Welcome back everybody to FTV Regrowth. Okay, there has been a very, very slight patch. The version is now 1.0.1. Okay, well, looking at my reputation there, I've got a reputation of 54. Now, according to comments from, from last episode, I need a, comment, uh, a uh, reputation of... 72 to get the Certus Quad seat. Now... I'm not seeing much more quest-wise from what the world is built from. No, no, not that one. Uh, where are we? Where are we? Where are we? Where are the world feels? No. I always get mucked up in this one. Not what the world enables. Okay, that's to do with... Blood Magic, Witchery. I'm pretty sure you don't need to go through Witchery to get through a lot more of the um, the mechanical stuff, but I believe maybe I might have to do something in here involving Mariculture, which does kind of make sense, and Bees, which kind of also makes sense too. Right, so... Let's make a scoop, not a steel scoop. Now, I might be able to make a mana steel scoop. Yeah, because these things burn through like crazy, so we're going to do that. Now, uh, do I have, uh, it doesn't look like I've got a block of, block of wool here, so... Let's go down and see the sheep. Encourage some wool from them. Head up, grab a... Um, yep, one of those. <laughs> oh dear. My brain's not fully in gear. I've only just woken up. Okay, so they've got our wool. Great, fantastic. We should have... We've got wood for sticks, so that's even better. Let's head on up. And grab some mana steel. Because no doubt I've got a heap of those. Uh, not in that chest, obviously. There we go. Lovely. Grab some sticks. Uh, I think I need more than four. In a pattern like such. Man, still eating it, and a piece of wool. Done. Boom. Right. Now, hopefully... Uh, looks like we've got more... We've got enough day... De enough time de of day, slash... Uh, well, basically daylight, to go out and find... Oh, well, here's a beehive. It's not the beehive that we're after. But we'll take that anyway. Now the bee that I have to find in my quest. Oh no. A modest princess. It could have been any modest princess. Nice. So I need to make a bee house now. Bee house. How does one make a bee house? Uh, any sort of comb and wood. Okay, cool, cool, cool. Luckily, we managed to get some from uh, breaking that beehive. Do, do, do. So, oh, I got wood and stuff on me. Let's, let's go into the witchery area and grab that crafting station. So we take a mundane comb, one of those, boom, done. Ha 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 ha, that was easy. Rip through the quests. That's what I love to see. Okay, claim around where we want. Breaking out in hives. Okay, so I need to make a modest hive. Now this, if I remember correctly, is a runic altar thing 
Okay, so and you need a princess, a, any kind of drones. I'm pretty sure of that. Of that. In there, so I need three of those. Sand, well, that I can make that uh, cactus, actual cactus itself. Well, luckily, you do, um, I'm very, fairly sure you actually do need proper cactus. So, oops, didn't mean to go for a swim there. So I'll go down, grab some cactus. We can make some sand up from the essence. We have to grab the essence as well. Are you a naturally spawning chicken? I don't think you would have got out of... That uh, must be a naturally spawn spawning chicken. Okay, so two, really? I thought that was three high. That one definitely got three. Okay, so we've nabbed our cactus. We have to go find another beehive. Oh. Actually, no, we're going to do this. In uh, some of my journeys, I've actually yeah, left a little bit of dirt around the place. So I can uh, find a trail back. Oh, there's another beehive. Beehives are generally fair, uh, like around the place. Just about everywhere. Uh... Sorceress Princess and Modest Princess. Actually, that, that Sorceress Princess is of, is of uh, pristine stock, so that's pretty good. But I don't have any drones. So I've got to get at least one drone so I can actually get the bee house actually up and going. I'm still getting pr princesses. This is not good, peoples. This is not good at all. Well, I'm going to uh, make a cut here. I'm going to stick these princesses in here. And uh, we'll be right back once I've collected a drone or the uh, enough drones. Okay, well, didn't actually get too far. I managed to find another hive and we do have one drone. So that's actually pretty cool. So the place where we're going to start having our, our little beehives, I suppose we can probably start up around here. It's generally fairly... Uh, actually, the bees themselves, they do need clear sky to work from. So that's going to be a little bit of a problem too, because i got this nice canopied area down here, and for some particular reason, my world's not loading that well. Although I've got a bit of free sky here, so we can start something. So, bee house. Stick you there. Got one more. Actually, that's a pristine one. Hmm. So, there and there. They shall mate. And uh, no flowers. What? There are plenty of flowers about. Uh. Now, there are different kinds of flowers that I'm aware of. Now, I'm guessing that this particular bee needs cactus. At a guess. Uh, do I actually have any sand? Well, we can go make some. So that's not an issue. Uh, it's fire and earth. Ah, uh, there's always an imbalance. So, I'm, I had a guess, I'm pretty sure it's actually this way around. Is it? Yeah! I got it right the first time. I usually yeah, start making cobblestone. Alright. So. Cactus needs to be next to water, right? Uh, this is actually do well if... Are you happy now? No flowers. Hmm, it's not cactus. It's not actual flowers. Maybe it's... 
Maybe it's uh, vines, maybe? Okay, hot and arid. Apparently, hot and arid is good. Okay, I don't understand. I gotta stick some vines there. Temperate. And they have to be working at night as well. Okay. But we'll stick some vines around there anyway, and hopefully by the time they're done, we'll get some more drones. The other option is to... Uh, actually, can I make a... I can, I can actually make quite a few more of those. The thing with bee houses, they can't be piped in or out of, from what my recollection. So that's the only difference between bee houses and there's another kind of beehive. Um, it's just called bees, or no, that's extra bees. No, that's forestry. Forestry is, that's the bee house, it's the bee, that's uh, the apiary. And that requires an impregnated casing, which requires seed oil, which is another machine. I wonder, has this actually unlocked anything it says it unlocks the one quest elsewhere. So, it's not there. It's definitely not there. Uh, encoding life. That's life. That's encoding. Because it starts to lead into more forestry machines. So, what the world enables. No. Where does this quest unlock? Definitely not there. Definitely not there either. Well, it enables. No, embraces. I'm definitely not seeing any B-type quests around the place built from. Elsewhere, where else would that quest unlock? Not entirely sure. Huh. Okay, maybe let's try. Oh, we have to do the breaking out hives. That actually doesn't unlock a quest elsewhere. I want to know where that, that quest actually unlocks things. Safety business. Well, we can, we can do that in the meantime, I suppose. While uh, the bees are doing their thing. At night time. There's definitely a whole branch of quests regarding bees. I'm sure of it. Alright, we're going to leave you in here. And that goes in there, so we'll just leave that be for the time being. Grab some string, well basically spider essence to get string. And look at the sifter. I'm just basically grasping at straws right now. I'm just doing whatever quest I can possibly think of to get some advancement. Uh, whoops, went too far. I uh, still yet to actually make any more crops because I really, really don't want to. Trying to uh, avoid that as best as I can. <laughs> okay, uh, did I get all that? Yep, have now. Let's duck back up here and have a look at the mariculture stuff there's even a mariculture book which i've got a quest for that i haven't done either so the string uh now it's s s e i no i e 
It's not even that either. Ah, uh, sifter. Here we are. Air fishing net, which is one of those. So we've got to make our string to start off with. Like such. Uh, I think... This actually makes two of these. No, it makes four. I knew it was a multiple. I couldn't remember how many. many. Okay, so we've got our, our string. So we need sticks and wood. That makes two of those, which you do need. See what? Uh, no, I can't use my fishing net elsewhere. I've, I do have a pond though, which I can use. It's too bad I don't have a hopper hock lying around. So what I could do with these is. Well, those will occasionally catch fish. And if I have a hopper hock nearby, it'll actually... Whoop, I hear... Hello. Goodbye. I shall take your flesh, however. Alright, so... Let's go back to the quest book. Claim my reward of the grasshopper bait. Uh, fishy solution. Oh, okay. Um, the fishing rod requires cane and a clean inventory. <laughs> um, no, what can I? Wowie! I will look forward to apply it in the just sticks. Uh, paper, we'll shove in there. If I could remember where the paper was, that'd be fantastic. And we'll get rid of the arrows, because we don't really need those. Alright. Here's my row of sugar cane. Let's grab from this area. Uh, two? No, I think I need three. And of course it makes four. One, two, three... One, two, beautiful. Right. Uh, what do I got? I got to get a cod. So that means I'm going to get to go fishing. Yeah. Minecraft fishing. How much fun is this? Now, with these rods, if you haven't had any experience with mariculture before, you need your bait next to the rod and with this you can actually use it does tell you what sort of bait that you do require and right so we're just going to go into our little pond we throw our rod in and we get raw spider fish so we have to get a particular a cod and raw salmon it does actually take a little bit, so I'm actually going to go back to a crafting station, grab a chest, because this is going to take some time. Uh, da -da -da. And a bit of patience. Until we get my cod. So let's put that down there. Ouch! In the water! Right. So, we'll stick our chest here. We'll stick our fish in here. And continue to fish. And we'll be right back when I get my cod. Actually, it could have been any fish. Because I, I didn't actually catch a female cod. I've caught minnows purchase so it must have just yeah so you know now for next time claim my reward feeding time once you have some live fish you'll build a tank to keep them in different sort of fish. 
The species require different sized tanks. Right, so we need to make a fish feeder. Now this will give me geneticist rep. Hmm. It's not the reputation I require. <laughs> it's a bit of a side project, if anything. So let's put our fish oil tank in here because it's just a good place for tanks right now. And uh, where am I going to have my fishing area? Well, considering this is where the oysters are, maybe I'll start it over here. Sifters, they work like that. Two blocks together. Uh, let's go grab a, another chest, perhaps. Uh, the Actually, the book. I believe it helps us complete another quest elsewhere. Here. Which, apparently, I've got all those, so... We'll get that reward. Might as well. Uh, da, 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 where was I? Encoding of the world. Definitely gotta find out where that other quest actually unlocked. That's gonna annoy the crap out of me. Alright, so I would like another chest. Uh, a couple, actually. Uh, one, two... For a double. And we'll stick all them fishing gear over this way. So we've got our, our rod. Our rod. That rod will actually use other in particular things. We can use our, put our fishing rod here. Uh, experience in books. Okay. And the grasshopper. So that was kind of interesting. Didn't really get me where I needed to go. In fact, let's have a, another look through the, the quest book. Okay, that raises Arcanist and Gen Geneticist rep. Maybe... Yeah, let's see if we can concentrate on that. The sand. Uh, cactus. Let's see, let's see what happens with the hive. Or well, maybe actually we'll make... Make up some more hives. Maybe that'll be a good idea. Because I've got a few uh, like other princesses that I could possibly use. Where did I put that? Uh, did I actually stick it in a chest down this way? Or no? Yep, I sure did. Do I actually have any wood down here? Nope. And... Nope. And definitely not. Do, 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 do. Definitely wood there. So I'll grab those. Do that. And we'll slap some more bee houses down. Okay, so that's definitely taking its time. Stick you there. Stick you there. And I'm going to have to basically go out and find... Okay, so that's... Ah, it's actually quite good that I've actually got this magic biome here because I've got hot and arid, which is just one block over. And regular temperature, normal and normal, in here. That's actually pretty cool. It's a good move. Definitely a good move. So, what are we going to do between episodes? Probably catch some more bees. See if I can't get some more drones, and see if we can't, uh, like, complete another quest. And I'm going to look for where that other quest unlocks, because I don't really know. 
Okay, so if, of course if you enjoy the series and you've got this far in the video, please go ahead and click that like button for me. And of course, if you wouldn't mind, perhaps uh, like share my videos on places like Facebook. Um, I wouldn't. I was about to say Dropbox. It's actually Discord and uh, Twitter, of course, and other places. Okay, folks. Well, I've been Raytech. I shall see you next time.